I want you to stop getting body back in your pickleball games. Let me show you what slow hands look like. You're always gonna have somebody that's a little bit better than you. Somebody that has a little bit faster hands. And you should be playing with them or playing against them so you can get better. That's how you're gonna get better faster. But what can you do off of the court to make sure that you are working on your hand speed and just getting better at the game overall? The best thing to do is obviously play the sport. Play against people that are better than you. Learn to anticipate what, what people do when they're in certain positions and just get more reps under your belt playing the game. Maybe you're a fiend for the sport, but you just can't get to the courts and play 24 seven or get there, out there as much as you like. Maybe you wanna do things at home. Today, I'm gonna give you a couple of exercises that you can do with just a tennis ball and a wall to help improve anticipation, improve coordination, as well as improve your hand speed. Two things first, shout out to Yola Pickleball for sponsoring this episode. They actually sponsor my whole channel this year. I'm super excited to be partnering with them. They have the best gear in pickleball. So if you're interested in paddles, especially pickleball gear, shorts, sleeves, polos, literally anything, go to Yola Pickleball, yolausa.com check them out. Number two, drop down into the show notes below and subscribe to my email list. We are sending out a weekly newsletter just with giveaways, with updates on what's going on within our training programs, as well as free weeks of training for pickleball elbow, for pickleball training, different things of that nature. If you're interested in training, subscribe to my newsletter. So all you're gonna need is one to two tennis balls at a time, a wall, and a little bit of patience because you might be really, you might excel at this in the beginning or you might be horrendous, who knows? But here's a couple drills for you. Remember that these drills aren't a main contributor to hand speed, right? If you just go do these, you're not gonna be the fastest guy on the court, but they can help you with focus, eye tracking, awareness, anticipation, as well as contribute to hand speed, but they're not a major contributor. If you're an addict for the sport, give these exercises a try, right? Maybe you can't get out to the courts all the time, do these exercises at your house. All you need is a tennis ball maybe 10 to 15 minutes, go through some of these exercises. Work on your eye tracking, work on your anticipation, as well as your hand speed, getting and catching the ball. Maybe you don't struggle with hand speed, but maybe you have the dreaded pickleball slash tennis elbow. Maybe you're struggling with elbow pain, check out this video here. 